Hey guys, this is a new one about converting a movie rendered with Blender to an animated GIF using FFmpeg. Ok, let's have a look at the animation first, it's a very simple one just to have an example. Here you see it in Blender 2.90 in the render preview. I use Eevee as render engine. I added keyframe animations for the objects and for the camera. So when I press the zero key on the numpad, you can see the scene through the camera. And this is how it will be rendered. The animation contains 200 frames. I set the resolution to a square, it is 512 pixels, 24 frames per second, and the file format I set to FFmpeg. Ok, then I define the container, I set it to MPEG4. For the video codec I use H264 and the output quality well, I set it here to almost lossless, but set it as you like. And then I defined here the directory for the output. And that's it for the settings. Now you can press Ctrl F12 to render the movie. I speed this up. The EV rendering is fast, but not that fast. Ok, we rendered the movie, the next thing we need is FFmpeg to convert the movie into an animated GIF. Or a different format. You can get the source code if you like, but I download here the binaries for Windows. I'm using Windows 10, but it is available as well for Linux or Mac OS. I download the version 4.3, the latest release. The download is just a zip file and it contains these executables. And I recommend to add the binary folder to the path. On a Windows system, this is the environment variable path, to which I just added the folder. Because then you have the possibility to open a command prompt and just type in ffmpeg and it will be found. Ok, now I change to the directory to which I rendered the movie. Here see it, it's the mp4, the name is a bit cryptic. And to create an animated GIF with a good quality, the first thing you do is to create a palette, a color palette from the movie. And I created it like that, but I changed the scale to 512 as our movie. And now I can use this palette also as an input to create the GIF from the movie. And that's it, now you can open the animated GIF. Of course it is an old format and it just has 256 colors, but it will be displayed automatically when you post it on Twitter or Facebook, so it is still useful. You can use FFmpeg to convert to other formats as well, like WebP. By the way, I will paste all these lines to the description below and also to an article to a post on my webpage. I defined this WebP as lossless and the quality I set to 80. I also defined it as a looping animation and the size I set to 512. Ok, and here we have it displayed in the browser, in Chrome. And that's a great quality. And the last format that I want to show is the APNG. Which also gives great results. But these APNGs for instance are blocked on Twitter and Facebook. At least the autoplay. Because it was misused, so keep that in mind. But anyway, I wanted to show you these features as well. And as I said, there will be a post on my website. And by the way, I have a new feature now on the page that you can suggest a YouTube video for sharing. You just go to this form, add a title, the video URL, a description and your mail and send the suggestion and I will take it into consideration for posting. So if you like, use this opportunity a short post containing your video will look like this. Alright guys, that's it again. I hope you liked the tutorial and if you like my channel then don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. 
Also follow me on my social media on Twitter, Facebook or Instagram. If you have any questions, then add these to the comments below. And I'll see you soon here on JNM.